We'll see how these two teams play in this game as they prepare for the opening kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. After a nice run up the middle. Good gain by the tailback of about seven on the option play. It's second and three. Ball on the 32-yard line. Gets it out quickly. Gain of two. And a great job of not allowing this explosive freshman to do anything with the ball after the catch. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. the ball for a nice game. So the halfback picks up the first down there with that six-yard gain. Pretty simple here. Toss play to the halfback, and with good blocking up front, he's able to scamper ahead for a decent game. Tosses out to the tailback on the screen. He's tackled at about the 43-yard line. From their own 43-yard line, it's second down. Down he goes at the 41. Loss of two by the halfback. Great penetration into the backfield, and that was just a great hit to finish off the play. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike to 59. Here we go. Wide 80. Wide 80. Check, check. Tiger. They knock it down, incomplete. And that one probably should have been picked off. Yeah, are you kidding me? There's a blanket around that receiver. Somebody else had to be open. Certainly, they don't have the return on here. Booming kick. Makes it to the 22-yard line. The Hurricanes have got a guy at quarterback that is a true leader. We found that out this week talking to him. We sure did, Brad. It was interesting this week and as you and I prepared for this game, finding out that he called a players-only meeting without any of the coaches just to get this team focused and let them understand what it takes to go on the road and to win this kind of game. And when you have that kind of leadership, you've got a real chance to be able to go on the road and win. The running back gets two on the carry. That makes it second. Second and eight, ball on the 24-yard line. Mike 12. Nearly picked off, but he couldn't hold it. That was textbook coverage by the defense. That's exactly what you want to do on every single pass play, but it doesn't always happen. They're one of the loudest crowds in the country, and they are on their feet. Caught out in the open. He's out of bounds at the 43. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. First and 10. Ball on the 43. Three down, three down. Three down, three down. 12 the mic. The junior makes the pitch, and he's hit before he can go anywhere. That's good for him. Seven yards. That makes it second and two. Oh, man. Hey, we got tight left, tight left. Four down, four down. Mike 12. Mike 12. Here we go. Run, run, run. They get with a run, and he brought down in the backfield. Oh, 
Third down again. They can't hear a thing down there. Zips it to the back, and he's tackled at the 43-yard line. away and it's a booming punt this one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback this is a fun game and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over nice run up the middle From their own 25 yard line. Second down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike to 59. Makes the catch and look out. Tackle around the 34 yard line. And he makes it out to about the 37 yard line. It's second down, seven to go. Ball on the 37. Caught with room to work. And he's taken down at the 47-yard line. Superb effort by the receiver to come down with that ball. Well, this comes down to the timing between the quarterback and the receiver. And the result, again, a nice play for the offense. They hand it off. Makes it out to about the 40. That's another first down, Brad. And right now, you can just really feel and sense the rhythm that this offense is in. Their ability to pick up first downs, just pushing this defense further and further down, back deep into their own territory. And he gets a yard on the run. From the 39-yard line, second down. We played one, still no score. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Three down, three down. Check 59, Mike. Mike is 59. Set. Mike is 59. And he's stopped behind the line. Nowhere to go for the halfback. That's a loss of one. That brings, that brings up third and ten. ten. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 30. Three down, three down. Brought down right around the 24-yard line. He looked pretty cool back there. Even with the outside linebacker blitzing, he made an accurate throw, and the result is a new set of downs. It's the ninth play of the drive. They're packed in tight on the line. Here we go! That's not what you hope for from your running game. You're looking for some solid north and south progress. You never want to give the defense a play like that to build their confidence. From the 28-yard line, it's second down. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike to 59. Ready! Slings it out there. Tight end's got another one. That's a great tackle at the 28. This is the 11th play of this drive. And 
he is drilled at the 17. I know the defense would have liked to have prevented such a big game, but the important thing is that they held and brought up fourth down. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. Florida could take the lead with this field goal. The kick is up, and it splits the uprights. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Out of bounds around the 27-yard line. That makes it second and eight. It's second and eight. Ball on their own 27. comes in and scoops up the fumble. And they make the stop around the 24-yard line. So it's the cornerback that comes up with a fumble, and this ball will change hands. Fumbles will absolutely drown an offense. It's hard to get into a rhythm when you make mistakes like that. So the offense will come out onto the field to take over once again. They got three points on their last drive. But with this kind of field position, they should be looking to get the ball into the end zone. A yard, maybe two on the carry. Solid stop there by the corner on that one. I'll tell you, I love to see a cornerback willing to step up and make tackles like that. From the 22-yard line, second down. Florida holds a field goal lead. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Tackled after decent pickup. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Tackles him hard at the eight-yard line. That's a gain of two on the play. That brings up second and goal. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike to 59. Let's go. Green 88. Boy, was he drilled as he let go of that football. Yeah, he's going to feel that one tomorrow. The defense has really held their own the last two plays. Now it's third and goal from the seven. Just gets rid of it. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Kicks up, and they tack on three points. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Both defenses really played well so far. Well, up to this point, both defenses have dominated this football game. We'll see if they can hold on to that mentality the rest of the way. The offense couldn't hang on to the ball last time around. Let's see what happens here. The defense, I'm sure, will be aggressive again. They love going for the strip and attacking the football. Makes a catch, and he's got nowhere to go. That play was going nowhere. Yeah, give a lot of credit to the defense here, recognizing pass and swarming to the receiver. We've got a second and nine here. Ball on the 26-yard line. Everything about that play was crisp. The route, the throw, the catch, that's fun to see. The crowd really making it difficult. And he 
he can't get away from the pressure. Oh, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman, when the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday. Now, he really got a hold of that one. Brought down at the 41-yard line. Everywhere we go in college football, everybody's got a T-shirt that says finish, finish. Whether that means finish the game or finish the drive. Right now, this offense is moving the ball, but they're not finishing the drive. They got to execute better down closer to their opponent's territory. Florida, up six. Tries to get out of trouble, but he can't shake the defense. You can't take sacks like that as a quarterback. You just can't. If you can't find a receiver, get out of the pocket and throw the ball away. So it's second down and 13 yards to go following that quarterback sack. Four down, four down. Check 59. They'll bring him down around the 43 yard line. That'll bring up third and eight. Hammerhead! Hammerhead! Scrambling around. Tackle made at the 44. Quarterback picked up a yard at best there on the scramble. Miami's going to have to use their second time out of the half. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Right, everywhere we go when we travel all over the country, people want to talk about offense. Oh, the spread or the pistol. Hurry up, tempo offense and points. It's nice to watch a team that prides itself on playing great defense. And when it's all said and done, the teams that advance and get to the important bowl games and do well in the postseason are teams that have this kind of defense. Zips it to the tight end, and he's tackled right away. Three, maybe four yards on the pass. You know, little passes like this force the defense to start to come up. Then you can see an offense take their chances downfield later to take advantage of the defense starting to cheat up. It's second down, six to go. Ball on their own 24. 46 is right there. Check him, check him. Let's go. 980. Why? 80. Hot, hot. And it's caught, and he's brought down quickly. We've still got a half of football remaining. The Gators in front by six. We've played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. A tight, hard-hitting, low-scoring affair. Great hey, affair. This, this Great. Is right, you can say it like it is. This is right in your wheelhouse, Pollock. I mean, this this is exactly in your comfort zone. No, I, absolutely. I mean, you like to see people flying around. You like to see defenses dictating to offenses and make them play on our terms. And it's it's fun to watch. It's something that as a great every great defense prides themselves prides themselves on tackling you know you didn't see very many missed tackles in the first half that led to big plays and try to limit those big plays and when they do get down towards the red zone make people kick field goals and that's that's how you see dominant defenses year in year out and, and that's what we're seeing today just about time to start the second half what, what do you think herb street's first point of analysis will be uh, I don't know, something to do with quarterback play, I'm sure. I mean, we always got to hear that stuff all the time. It's all about the quarterbacks. Brad and Kirk ready for the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Gators continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. And down he goes. 
goes at the 34. That's good for a gain of nine yards. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. A one yard gain by the halfback. Listen to this place. He's taken down at the 46. From their own 46 yard line. First down. Dumps it complete over the middle. He's tackled at about the 43 yard line. First down. He's going to try and scramble, and they got him. The offensive line has to at least slow the guy down a little bit. He was in there in no time. It's second and 15. Ball on the 49. up a yard. That makes it third and 15. Here comes the screen and they can't connect. That would have been pretty remarkable if he'd managed to hold on to the ball after taking a shot like that. He doesn't want a touchback here. He wants to knock this ball inside the 10. He punts. No, he won't. Got an opening. Touchdown, Florida. Man, that was a super play by the defender. Excellent interception and an even better return for the score. He makes the PAT. They line up to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Let's see how the defense responds now, coming off that big play just a moment ago. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off of mistakes. Fires out quickly to the tailback. That's some pretty timid play calling right there. Let's see if they decide to open it up a bit more. That'll make it second and seven. Second and seven. Ball on their own 28. Check back 12. Back 12, back 12. Ready. Green 88. He scrambled. Tackle at the 30. He scrambled, but he didn't get much. Brad, this defense reacts too quickly for a scramble like that to work. He needs to spread him out a little bit more to try to create more room to run. Really a tough spot for an offense to be in against this crowd in this stadium. And he's level at the 19-yard line. Coaches don't like it when their quarterback gets hit like that. Don't be surprised to see the old coach get on his lineman to protect the quarterback a little bit better. And that's three and out. Nothing going on that series. Fourth and long here after the sack. Oh, excellent punt. 
He's taken down at the 38-yard line. Not great, but not bad either. As long as your main priorities are not turning the ball over and establishing solid field position, then you're heading in the right direction. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. Taken down right around the 44-yard line. So it's second down now. They need about four yards to pick up the first. He's going to go for the home run. This one's intercepted. It's the sophomore safety. There you go. If you're going to come back in this game, it's going to start with one play. And maybe that pick is what turns things around for you. Double tight, double tight. Four down, four down. Mike 12, Mike 12. Ready! The ball is loose. He picks it up. And he's tackled at about the 33-yard line. The running back won't be happy that he lost the ball. He's got to forget about it and get ready for the next series. His offense is going to need him again. The quarterback threw an interception on their last drive. Let's see if they can be more successful here. Giving the ball away can rattle your confidence, but he just needs to relax and not try to force it. He's starting off in great field position now. On the ground, and he won't get back to the line. Loss of one yard on the play. That, that makes, makes it second and ten. ten. Second down, ten to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Flips it, middle to the running back. Brought down at the 27-yard line. Number 22 brings him down at the 27-yard line. That'll bring up third and four. They're about four yards away here on third down. Three down, three down. Three down, Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Watch down, and he's going to get sacked. Loss of six or something. Fourth down. He gets it up, and he nails the long field goal. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. This defense has everything. They kind of have that blue-collar, workman-like approach, but they also have a blend of tremendous speed to go along with that work ethic. And the better they play, they seem to feed off of it, and it continues throughout the whole ballgame. Hands it off. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. Loss of two on the run by the halfback. It's second down, 12 to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. Fires quickly to the tight end. He's hit and taken down. They're one of the loudest crowds in the country, and they are on their feet. And they make the stop at the 40. And this is still anyone's ball game as we head into the final quarter of play. Florida's got a 16-point lead. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Four down, four down. Mike 12. Mike 12. Set. Green 90. And he is drilled at the 40-yard line. That makes it second and ten. From
from their own 40 yard line. It's second down. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. Fans are showing you why teams hate to come here, folks. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Booming kick. And down he goes at the 35-yard line. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. He chucks it downfield. And they intercept it. The sophomore safety. It looked like the pass was sailing out of reach, but he just climbed the ladder and made a spectacular interception. From their own 34-yard line, it's first down. Here we go! Red 85! Easy, easy, easy! Now he tries to buy some time. He'll bring him down at the 42. That's a deal. That, that makes, makes it second, second and two. two. Too much time to react to that pass. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Really, one of the very tough places to play in college football, and it's no different today. And he tackles him hard at the 45 yard line. Gaining three yards. First down. Three down, three down. Mike 12. Mike 12. Ready. Now he's scrambling. Tackle made at the 47. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. And he's got it. And he's immediately tackled. Game seven on the play. First down. Ready! Run! 68! Run! 68! Pressured and run down. That'll bring up second and 15. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Just under three to go in regulation. Well, the defense has played so well for most of this game, and to be able to give up a big play like that can be demoralizing. This defense has got to kind of pick themselves up and try to finish this game off and get the win. Rifles this one out to the left. That close to being intercepted. You like a team that's ready to defend the pass. It takes some preparation to get in the way of a pass like that. Tenth play of the drive. Tackled after a decent pickup. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. Four down, four down. Mike 12. Mike 12. Quick 
release. Oh, had it knocked down. You know, that actually might have been a break for the offense. Sometimes tip passes can linger in the air and get picked off. Here's a step in the maturation of a young quarterback. How does he respond to throwing an interception on that last drive? One general rule in any game is to hold on to the ball. If you're in the negative in the turnover department, your chances of winning decrease exponentially. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on the seven yard line. The fight's forward to about the seven. And the halfback's got nowhere to go. Good job by the junior linebacker to read the run and limit the play to a short game. Just under two to go in the game. Here we go. Three. Hit on the throw. He caught it. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Miami will use their final timeout. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. He's tackled at the 46-yard line. Oh, here we go, Herbie. you got to love it. Final few minutes. It's crunch time. Love to get into the fourth quarter with the game still yet to be determined. We'll find out who's going to make a play to win this thing. They'll take over here, ready to start a new series. Going deep. This one will fall incomplete. It can be tough making a play on the ball sometimes, but that's probably a pick he should have made. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 46. Let's go! 180! Wide! 180! He airs it out. Picked off. It's the cornerback. And that interception, I think, is going to do it, partner. Him hard at the 29. They go with a run, and that'll be a gain of nine. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. They're packed in tight on the line. Here we go. Green 95. And he makes it out to about the 31 yard line. This one's in the books and our final score 16 to nothing Gators. Kirk, go ahead and just give us your reflections on this game. They've talked about the rivalry all week long, and for good reason. We saw the intensity down on the field every play, and it showed us why these teams love to hate each other. It'll be interesting to see how this game carries over the next time they play.